Hi. Yeah, I can tell because the video quality dropped off. Oh, I'm sorry. Does that always happen? <laughs> no, it just did it for a second. But I'm guessing if you've got two different feeds out of your console, um, your bandwidth is a little bit taxed. Uh, let me go to Discord real quick. I just want to, I want to boost my viewers. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't spell. Protocol. I'm surprised that doesn't come up in your uh, autocorrect. I don't have autocorrect on. Probably for the best. <clears throat> yeah, I, it's mostly for the best. Remember one time autocorrect. No. Maybe you do want autocorrect on, because I remember one time, instead of honeymoon, I typed out horny moon, and it did not autocorrect. <laughs> Which, I mean, it's not a terrible alternative word for it. It's just not quite tactful and appropriate, you know. Yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> okay. You know, I feel like at a certain point the uh, these uh, EULAs should probably be illegal, like, to be this long. I unlocked hardcore. How? Uh, I Try guess to survive by... Again. Huh? Dismemberment mode? <laughs> Who's Jacob? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Mission <it's> complete. <laughs> okay. What? <laughs> Main menu. Well, I'm just new experience. Normal yeah. moves. Oh. Oh. Um. Oh, medium security. Yeah, I feel like normal mode is the correct option, although it would have been nice if they explained what medium security meant. I have no idea what it's supposed to mean. Uh, performance mode, I guess. When did this, this game came out, what, last year? <laughs> I thought it was no. more. Years ago, I think. Uh, okay. Get spoopy. Meanwhile, in the ascent, for some reason. <laughs> All right, where's Johnny Silverhand? I thought that was funny. I know who Johnny Silverhand is. Huh? What? I thought it was funny. Oh, no, that was good. Did you not hear me laugh? No. Oh, no, you were uh, muted. Or, like, you were totally silent. Uh, no, I, I, I mean, I more like snickered. <laughs> Can't say I didn't see that coming. Massacre on Europa.
uh, subtitles. Roger, hangar control. Laying in course for Europa Station. You got something to say? You're gonna keep flicking that thing all day. Ah, oh, just like flicking my thing. That it's came out wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say that is. <laughs> Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> that was fucking hilarious. Oh. <laughs> Take the security pretty serious. And what about the attacks? Huh, how do you explain that? By the outer way? They've been hitting targets all over the sector for the past six months. <laughs> it's gonna be the title of that video when you put it on YouTube. I just like flicking the thing. Well, it's still worth checking out. <laughs> I mean, if you really want it to be that, okay. <laughs> you shouldn't worry so much, you know. Live longer. Ooh, title of your sex tape. sensors are both showing error. Go check them out. I'm going. Okay. Open door. Thank you, lady. Open containers. Pick up items. Oh. Your doctored Callisto hangar. It's coming out my controller. Quarters while they load the cargo. Max has been on my case about these Europa runs. We've done jobs like this before. Don't know why he cares so much now. It's just a job. You gotta keep your head down and your mouth shut. Okay. 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 Getting my bearings. <coughs> Learning controls. I can't see shit. That's completely my fault. Okay, there is a thing stopping me from going downstairs. Why is my character already wary of what's going on? <laughs> I, I can zoom in my vision. Uh, you know, you're just looking harder. Yeah. Oh, out of my hands now. This better be worth the trouble. I definitely would not open that. I'll be good. Check out the rest of the ship. Can I get a flashlight? Fucking son of a bitch. Yeah. I guess I'll check the other side. I kick. John Callisto. Game Callisto Protocol. Oh, why are things Credits. going to Max, we got trouble. What's up? We've been boarded. Oh, shit. The outer way? Yeah, I'm guessing. All right. All right, well, will you get your ass back up here? And watch your back? You know, they could be anywhere. Now I'm watching. Oh, I didn't know you weren't watching. I was still in the middle of my game when you started. You're good. My bad. No, 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 you're good. I could have said something. They're told. It's gotta be here somewhere. I don't... Shimmy? Shimmy? Do a little shimmy. shimmy. Don't forget shape. Damn, field's still in effect. Not for long. 
What dampening field? It's a sprinkler not. system. How should I know? Get it. Damn. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Although now that you mention it, this uh, this ship looks weirdly humid. I don't like knowing how to sprint. Frankly. Oh no! <laughs> you dumb woman. Well, I mean, um, turnabout's fair play. Yeah, yeah. you were venting them. <laughs> think I'm doing? <laughs> oh, that's bad. Ship's caught the moon's gravity. We're being pulled in. Oh, I don't know, engines, maybe? There's a guy in the pilot seat. I wonder why I don't have any, like, astronaut suit or anything. It's just a leather jacket. That is the astronaut suit. It's okay, Star-Lord. Uh, well, too fucking bad. Uh, Bald. Let me actually, there's a, um, audio, can I turn, okay, good. Startling me. Uh. Oh. I still have no idea why you guys don't use headphones. Ooh, that's, ow. It's he's just cosplaying as two two face. It's okay, right? Jacob, hey, close your mouth. You're gonna catch flies. have been programmed for pleasure. Black Assume the position. You the pilot? <laughs> yeah. You hear him? He's gone. And we'll just need the one. Okay. Uh, get you out of here. Manifest says you were running cargo out of the hangar. Don't get many of you freelancers out here. Don't I know it? For, ship I ever lost. Were they boarding his ship because they thought he was smuggling, or? I thought he was gonna turn around and punch her in the gut. <laughs> You let me do my job, punch.
That's what they all say. The Callisto Protocol. Roll credits. Ding. I am playing this downstairs in a completely dark room. Because you hate yourself. Because I hate myself. <laughs> My name is Jacob Lee. I'm not an inmate. You were inmate. 532-521. You address me as Captain Ferris. What? No, no, no. I'm just a cargo pilot. I was attacked by the outer way. By her. She crashed my ship and she killed my first officer. I don't care. Warden Zors. Oh, speak of the devil. Rejoice. And rejoice in your life has led you here. To this moment. To this place. The only place where Find the one thing that has always been missing. A purpose for your meaningless life. Do you get your... This is <laughs> Do you get all of your... Uh, methodology and philosophy from Warden Sharp from Arkham Asylum? every <laughs> time. Gives me chills every time. <laughs> Right, I don't belong here. Listen, you know they call Callisto the dead moon. Dead. Just like you would have been if I hadn't fished you out of that wreck. I mean, shit. As far as anyone else is concerned, you are dead. It's time you moved on. Because you're crossing over to a new culty. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's very culty. Is entirely in my hands. That doesn't Okay. Grab her. Let's go. Now entering Black Gate Prison. Oh, we are in Arkham. <laughs> or Gotham. Damn it. Oh, he's assuming the position. According to the UJC penile code. No! No! You're a goddamn doctor! Yes, I intend to faithfully execute my responsibilities. Try not to move, it'll only make things worse. Fuck you! I was about to say that that should make you at least pass out, shouldn't it? Yeah. Oh, is this gonna be like Dead Space? That's my health bar. Yeah, yeah. probably. Maybe guess in universe it's like a tracking device and or a Suicide Squad head exploder thing. Guess so. Well, at least they didn't put him in a prison jumpsuit. Still wearing a stylish leather jacket. There's my toilet, completely exposed to the guards. I mean, if they want to see my butt, that's fine, I guess. Honestly, I think the coolest thing in the cell is that screen right there. Like, 
Imagine trying to sleep with that. Couldn't, I don't think. Please, please. Yeah, no. I, I'm exploring myself. I'm not sure there's much more. Oh. There's a thing on the floor. I didn't even see that. Well, oh, they did put you in a jumpsuit. Yeah, yeah. You're not wearing your stylus. Oh, oh, damn it. This is not a drill. <clears throat> but fear itself. Right. You think? B.I.P. Um, best in peace. Aww. Sorry, right, dude. Are there any other inmates here? What? I P N F. Bitch, I'm pregnant, not fat. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck is going on? I don't know what the hell's going on. My ship crashed, I got thrown in here, and then I woke up to this. Well, look, 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 look. You're that pilot they just brought in, yeah? Yeah, well, look, I've been in here half my life. I know this place. I've got a plan to get out. If you help me out of this cell, I'll help you, yeah? You can use this to get inside a control room across that bridge. You can open myself from there. My name's Elias, by the way. Jacob. Don't lose it, Jacob. Is that? Save your life. It is a shiv from a wrench. Yeah. That's, that's kind Maybe, of impressive. Uh, yeah, that would hurt. Also, it would take forever to make. I think that's what's most impressive to me. The amount of time it went about prisons and shivs. Um, I was on my mission. I did three months in Ely, Nevada. Mm -hmm. And in Ely, Nevada, there is a high security, like maximum pen like like maximum security penitentiary out there. Murderers and gang, gang members and stuff like that. Uh -huh. And uh, I knew a guy who was a guard who got stabbed by an inmate while he was transferring them from one cell to another. And the only reason he survived is because he had extra padding on his belly. He, the doctor was like, if you had had a, like one inch less of fat, it would have pierced a vital organ. You probably would have bled out. That's it. Like, I'm never exercising. <laughs> Dead bod. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Hercules. Let's open this. Oh, hello. I'm. Not a guard. I'm not intruding. Just a cargo ship pilot. Good heavens! Yeah, that one's a zombie. I only got hit once, I think. Hey, I got a better weapon. <laughs> I will take it. I should do it. I think that's a conduit bit. Yeah, that's what it looks like. There isn't a window. Just be. <laughs> 
Oh, hell. Never dodge in the same direction more than once. Got it. And off the con. Say what? The an Opticon is a type of prison. It's a prison model where you have a central tower that looks into, and you end up kind of developing a sense of helplessness. I certainly feel helpless. Especially if they're just going to go, here's combat. There's no timing or anything. This isn't Batman. You're going to fucking die. <laughs> Uh, I just got static. Think whatever you saw, it's all the more reason to get out of here. Oh yeah. <clears throat> so this is the sane man in a horror movie. Yeah, so he's he's very dead. Hear that? Oh, hi. It's a warning to you stay in your fucking cell. Isaac stomp. Any of you. Oh, I don't like this. said health injector. Cinematic. Oh, 
Oh, oh well. Elias, something's wrong with the elevator. I'm heading down, not up. And very quickly. That means you're headed to solitary. You can still reach the watchtower. Just have to go the long way. I Just don't. Be careful. They keep the real crazies down there. Oh, thank you. Oh, fuck you. I should have seen that coming, but... How's it hanging? Yeah, not so well anymore. <laughs> wow, the audio on my end is like three seconds delayed. Oh, jeez. <laughs> That's a lot of blood. Don't like that. Fuck you. Thank you. Oh, you will let me in here. Do you really want to be in there? That, that looks like... Um, I don't want to be in here like anymore, that's for sure. Yeah. It kind of looked like somebody uh, used the restroom everywhere other than the toilet. Not for sure someone was gonna something was gonna happen to those that that, that there. <coughs> oh well, I sure. like that. <laughs> Fuck you. Ooh. Oh no. Oh he vented. <clears throat> Maybe climbing in your air vents, snatching your people up. Imagine you're playing nope. a super serious, like, horror game like this. And, like, just for one scene, the monster is just, like, an Among Us character. <laughs> <laughs> like, the rest of the game, totally normal, but just one scene to just make you think you're going crazy. Those goofy astronauts. <laughs> oh, huh? But don't look at it again. It was gross <laughs> enough the first time. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you. I thought you said, "Oh, like you saw something." Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh shit. like gross. Like there's a toilet that is just completely full. Uh, I've seen enough hentai to know where this goes. Oh shit, bro! One of my mates. I've known him forever. It was, it was this thing. He attacked me. Are you holding a gun? No. No, oh, fuck you! Oh, what the <laughs> fuck? shit! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> How dare you! <laughs> well, it's good to know that the bodies are potentially dangerous. <laughs> ah, yes. The inanimate corpses are hostile. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, another health injector. Good, good. How about a gun? I mean, what do you think a health injector is? It's a, it's a gun that shoots healing at extremely and offen short ranges. An offensive gun, Eric. I mean, I'm sure some doctors would find the idea of a health injector very Eric? I mean... <laughs> <laughs> well, else did we both say Eric at the same time? <laughs> That, that little that little chuckle Eric gives. <laughs> okay, real quick, I have to tell you. <laughs> uh, hold on, I'll wait for the dialogue to finish. Why? So. Vincent started kind of making up his own songs, and one of the songs is What's the Weather? What's the Weather? What's the Weather like today? And he's. Well, I'm. So. He's, he started making up his own lyrics to it. He's like, Is it rainy? It's sunny. Ooh. And then he goes, Is it. Damn. Area secured. Moving to medical sector. These guys have broken the first law of robotics. Ooh. You know, it's weird that Asimov didn't think of the, the idea of uh, military robots. Yeah, I, seeing as that's one of the first things we do with new tech is try to weaponize it. Yeah. Hey. Uh... Oh, oh, oh. Hmm? Elias, they can't track us. Prison systems are breaking down like that elevator back there. Just stay out of their line of sight and you should be able to sneak by. All systems nominal. That's a cool robot voice. Here are you. Hey. Hey. Just gonna sneak by. Oh shit. Black Iron Security Unit active. Ooh. Yeah, that's just like the robot equivalent of walking around yelling, I'm awake. <laughs> like, good for Still you. Still like it. Legal force authorized. Oh, I thought he saw me. No, you won't see me. Weapon systems online. Why would you just casually say that? Fucking shit. Was that in the chest?
apparently. Oh. Ah, Ichabod. Good to see you. <laughs> what we call a cranial keratotomy. <laughs> Okay, cranial skull, otomies removal. What? What's a carrot? What, what's the carrot part of that mean? I don't know. <clears throat> Let me look it up. If no one likes how slow I'm going, you can kiss my ass. It's not dead space for Signalis, but it wasn't a bad stomp. What I don't want is to face those and the robots at the same time. It'd be kind of cool if you could third party them, though. Like, I don't know if that, that can actually happen in this game, but. I don't know that keratotomy is a word. I might have made that word up. Oh, okay. I mean, it sounds like a word. I mean, Otomy is definitely... I'll take that health. Lockdown. Yes, that worked out well for you. Craniotomy mm -hmm. is the word. The craniotomy. I'm assuming a craniotomy... <gasps> Fucking shit! Think of frickin', um, uh, I thought it was a similar situation to um, Outlast. The frickin', what was it, Billy? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, Miles? Is it the big guy who, like, sort no. of constantly chases you? No, it wasn't the big guy, it was the... It was a dude that was, like, strapped into some apparatus and his spirit was flying around doing shit. Oh, okay. Oh, I think so, yeah, William. Made it through the infirmary. Still looking for that weapons lockup. Okay, you're getting close. Just keep moving. You come back down. Like I'm not done with you. Band. Yeah. What was that? <clears throat> I thought that guy was going to jump into the fan. You know, of the ways to commit suicide, that is... That is a way. Yeah, but it's... That's... That's... <clears throat> that would hurt. Like, that would not be a clean way to go. Jacob, you find anything? 
The lockup had already been raided. All that's left is this baton. Stun baton, yeah. And those things do pack a punch, though. And we are gonna need it. Okay. Listen, you're almost to the watchtower. I had to sneak through, but it's empty now, so you should be good. I'll meet you on the other side. Yeah, I'll see you there. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Whoa! Why is that wall covered in spikes? I don't know, but I'm not really gonna argue. Alright, now you have oh, no chance. It's painted in video game hint yellow, too, so. <laughs> <coughs> that should be a color for, like, war paints, trip hazard yellow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You could just get like not awful to paint yellow, that that would be fine. I am not taking a chance with any corpses. Hey, and we're back to playing Doom 3. <laughs> <laughs> that game deserves a remaster. Yeah. It got a re-release, I think. I mean, if they clean it up enough, I'd... yeah. It's a VR game now, is what I'm saying. Eh, VR is not. I, I don't. A, I don't. VR have to still has VR. to get over. Still has to. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? They need. They need to figure out locomotion. Yeah. Like, the aim to teleport and move, I don't like those at all. What about yeah. the control stick to move? <clears throat> control stick to move would be fine. It's I okay, can... but still break some of the immersion. eye on you. Okay, you're good. You're clear. He got you. He got me. I didn't expect to be a second. I'll be right back. Okay. I didn't expect the second one. <laughs> yes, much like the Spanish Inquisition. Or a second uterus. I thought Miles would laugh at that one. Miles is away from the... Oh damn it, I didn't it... realize. <laughs> oh! Where'd you come from?
you all come from? Seems like that's the direction they want me to go, so I'm gonna head this way. Do a little bit of secret hunting. Yeah. All right. This looks familiar. Maybe I've been here before. Elias's, wasn't it? Nothing. Units, you are weapons free. Repeat, you are weapons free. Yes, sir. You. Okay, yeah. What? How the fuck did you get in here? You think I got time for this shit? Okay. Okay. Let me see if I got this straight. Uh. Then this whole place goes to shit. Oh, five, two, one. Hey. Look at me when I'm talking to you. What'd you do? Huh? You can tell me. Are you different? Are you special? Why'd the warden... Why you lie? Hi. Huh. I told you. This is my kingdom. It's all yours. Well, he is almost certainly not dead. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> Are they going to have to fight him as he is, or, you know, what you mean? mutated into some horrific monster? I'd like to have what Ferris had, though. Yeah, the, the uh, telekinesis gauntlet would be uh, nice. Especially if you can use it like a uh, physics gun. Like, just pick stuff up and throw it. 
Right. Gravity gun, not physics gun. I'm assuming it has something to do with um, the the thing I got implanted in me. Yeah, maybe. No, he affected you before you had that thing implanted on. Oh. You. Okay. Hot shit was about to happen. Please. Necessity. Oh. To do what is required. Shut up. He likes to hear himself talk. And not connect to black fire security net. System. Oh. One of those health injectors. Yeah, to hold the down button. I, I know it's a small gripe, but I really don't like two handing short weapons. Yeah. Like, wait, you mean the pistol or the. Uh, like this the little baton? stun baton. Little stun That's baton. a one handed weapon. Oh, yeah. That's a one handed weapon. I mean, to be fair, though, this guy's a random space pilot. I, I, he's probably oh, no, no, not. Don't I, I understand. And like I said, I know it's a nitpick. It's just a nitpick of mine. Oh, yeah. Jacob, well, here's the seizure oh. corner. Oh, that's not good. They can operate while headless. I officially like Elias. He did not have to rescue you. He totally could have just let you die. Absolutely went out of his way to help us. Yeah, he seems fairly likable. And given that we know this prison will falsely imprison people, uh, he might not even be a bad guy. Yeah. Also, trusting guy, given that he just handed you a gun. Or, you know, most of a gun. UGC print. The choice is yours. Man, I don't even get the first one for free. That took 800 credits. Okay, got it. If we're gonna get out of here, we need a ship, one that you can fly. Now, I found an inmate with the skills to hack the network and call one down from orbit. Bad news is they're in the shoe. Maximum security. It's fucking tough getting in there. Cool bothering you? It's gonna be mask lady. Like and scramble your brains a little bit. Don't worry, you get used to it. Yeah, you sure know a lot about this place. Yeah, I've had nothing but time. Okay, so what's next? The shoe? Can we just waltz our way in there? Yeah, I wish we could. 
It's not gonna be that easy, bro. Look, I've been here a long time. I've got privileges that you don't. So I'm gonna have to take you a different way. But I'll be your eyes and ears, and I'll guide you along. Now, don't you leave me hanging. I got you. Unless you know I'm part of that. I'm afraid not. I'll get that door for you. He is absolutely going out of his way to help. He definitely has a reason, because he is not a pilot. I mean, yeah, but that... That does also kind of imply that you're going to be safe, like, with him forever. Because, like, he's going to need a pilot to get off-world. And he's not going to stop needing a pilot until, like, he's, you know, safely landed somewhere else. Okay, I got a flashlight. What you doing? Oh. Oh. so far like just in the terms of the style and the way the uh, monster pods look there Okay. So when the little uh, target appears, what do you do? Like an auto headshot Hold or something? Aim. Hold the L2 to aim and then R2 to fire. Yeah, okay. Appears to be that the red circle means I am out of ammo. At least. Some... Okay. Something beep over your guys' is... No, that was you. Okay. I didn't hear anything. I'm pretty sure I had that happen to me a couple of weeks ago. Oh! Yeah, I guess. Damn it. Oh, that was cool. That's... That's satisfying is what that is. Hi, honey. The little one doesn't want to sleep. 
I'm not sure this is the best place to have him right now. <laughs> I am streaming, just so you know. Is this a uh, lower security? It's kind of interesting that they have desks. all the paperwork they inevitably have to do for this event. Ah. The and true cruel and unusual nightmare. punishment. The what? The true cruel and unusual punishment. Yeah, paperwork. <laughs> A list of so... cubicles. have been found guilty this court sentences sentences you to filling out everyone's tax returns or death oh, your choice help. give me the death sentence <laughs> i might actually ask for that after a while and tax returns like just non-stop tax returns i would yeah i would lose my mind I don't know how CPAs yeah. do oh, it. And to rub salt in the wound, it's it's really good returns. It's just never for you. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> See, everybody else gets really good tax returns, but... Ooh. Dad, go! How am I supposed Your to fight two at once? I think Back the answer is don't. All right, can you uh, disengage and re-engage? I did too. <laughs> yeah, I blinked. What happened? <clears throat> I walked over here. I started going over here, and I, the light there I thought was a dude with a flashlight. Oh yeah. anything while I'm crawling. I'm going to assume you're going to kill me once you hear me.
All right. I stomped on his chest and his leg popped off. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely how anatomy works. <laughs> Why is she limping? Because she's got an arrow in her chest. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what was the point of this detour? For later. To find security credentials. Look around for any dead guards nearby. Oh, I know where there's a dead guard. I just don't not, don't like where the dead guard is. It's this guy. Probably gonna kill. Him. Use your shift to dig out their implant. Wait, what? You don't have a choice. It's the only way through that door. I couldn't have just used key cards. But let's say, no, no, no. Also, look at where you're stabbing. You do not want to stab yourself. Yeah. He's definitely some kind of cultist. Well, someone had the pants scared off of them. <laughs> Heal yourself. Yeah, like a half dozen health injectors, right? No, I have one left. Oh, really? Shoot. I've been paying attention. Can I get more health drops? Relax in there. <laughs> Namaste. <laughs> be like one of your French corpses. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? Draw me like one of your French corpses. <laughs> There's a t-shirt idea. <laughs> Put like a zombie on it, just like relaxing yeah. on a couch. That'd be perfect. And what's over here? A zombie with a beret. Yeah, of course. Oh, ho, ho, live rains. <laughs> <laughs> That's what BIP stands for. Brains in pan. Ah, yeah, of course. 
Oh, observer. <laughs> Wait, what? Observer. Yeah. Observer. Yeah, from, uh, Mystery Frank? Science Theater. I don't remember that one. Which one was that one from? No, it's the brain guy. Brain guy. Oh, I forgot this. What they were called was observers. <laughs> it's been a minute. I hope that show gets another season one of these days. I want to go see Rift Tracks live. Oh, uh, yeah, that would be cool. put that I'm pretty sure they put that in there because they wanted no loading screens but they had to load it <laughs> somehow yep yeah yeah I mean as disguised loading screens go that's better than you know the 10 minute elevator apparently that's why the ladders in Bloodborne are so long Oh, like those are the loading screens? Okay. Yeah. I, I don't it. know about that. That's what a speedrunner said, at least. If they do ever remaster Bloodborne, I want them to make the Golden Ardeo helmet to actually make a sound when it clanks against the rubble <laughs> ladder. Yes. Also, that door that doesn't work, that was totally planned to work, they need to make it work if they ever remaster Bloodborne. <laughs> what door? Yeah, you know, the one. You know, the one, uh, it's on the bridge. Yeah. That, uh, it. Like, they modeled it. Like, the door literally exists on both sides, but it's not openable or interactable at all because of the hardware limitations at the time. Oh. Just back here. Got it. Death is coming. Pretty sure it already came, bud. Yeah, that amount of blood, it's it's here. Don't open dead inside. <laughs> Wait, don't dead open inside. I know, I know. <laughs> um, Officially found the church. Yeah, this is a cult. Ah, oh, crap. They're worshipping Bill Cipher. <laughs> A-X-O-T-L-O-L -L Ancient Spell
are we ever actually removed from the wild, though? Oh, this that right. <clears throat> um, June farm. What'd you say, Eric? Cube farm. That seems pretty removed from the wild. Cube farm? Yeah, you know, like you an office with like just cubicles. Oh. I'm referring to that idea that technically you're never ever removed from the wild because ultimately like even the things that remove you, quote unquote remove you from the wild uh -huh. are to the end that it achieves something Whoa. Oh no. That was bad timing. Shot was surprisingly not as uh, damaging as I would have expected. What I'm going to say is basically it's the idea that so, like. Yeah, being in a in a cubicle removes you from the wild, so to say. But ultimately, it's to the end that it accomplishes something that elevates the rest of humanity, so they live in, in a higher state of being. If that makes sense. Probably not. You don't hear me? Yeah, yes. I can hear you. Okay, yeah. I didn't know if you guys heard me or not. Or okay, yeah. sorry, I, I got distracted. No, no, you're good. You're good. I just wanted to make sure it, I didn't go like on mute though. All right, no. Okay, so yeah, the the idea that things that remove you from the wild are ultimately what again? It it, it it's ultimately to the end that you. So like, if I work in a cubicle, yes, I'm removed from the wild, so I'm not evolving to match the wild, but I'm evolving to uh -huh. match society, and so technically you're still evolving. Oh, okay, the evolving part. Yeah, I got it. You're, you're, you're never... Yeah. You're, you're never out of an environment where there are pressures. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, I was thinking, like, out of the wild, as in, like, out of like the natural state yeah and and i i was thinking like quote unquote wild as in like are we ever actually out of the wild no we're always in a state of change yeah 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 that, but definitely. i was looking at it metaphorically <laughs> gotcha It bothers me that this gun only seems to hold five bullets. Six. Oh, okay, six. That's an acceptable number of bullets. <laughs> <laughs> well, six bullets is a revolver. Five bullets yeah. is just not enough gun, right? <laughs> Especially if you're something the size of that, you know, Nerf hand cannon there. <laughs> VIP bullets in prison. Hey, you know what? I'm gonna look at what that actually does stand for. Black Iron Prison. Oh yeah, that would make sense. <laughs> it's the only prison on the entire moon. Why did they need to specify? <laughs> I'm in medical. Keep going to the back exit. I'll contact you there. Medic. <laughs> That was like playing Marco way Holden. too quick. The first case came in an hour ago, and they just keep coming. We're losing control. We have to find Mahler. Where the hell is she? Probably 
Okay, so, so Dr. Mahler is a key player in this. Dr. Mahler is code for a really big bear. I think Dr. Mahler is the one that implanted, that put the implant in us. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The bear would be funny, though. <laughs> would be funny. Beg your pardon? It would be, less, it would, it would be decidedly less funny if it was infected with whatever this thing is. Okay. I heard that. <laughs> oh, I hate shimmy in little pig. Oh, fuck. All right, it's one of those uh, hamlet things. I found one of those gloves that Captain Ferris had. That's a grip. Bastard guards love to use it on us inmates. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> but it's good. It works on all sorts of things, too. Go on, give it a go. Will do. Can I grab the rest of this dude's armor? Like, the helmet, maybe? Wait, is a helmet? Does he not have a helmet? <laughs> Technically, everybody has a helmet inside of their, like, underneath their scalp. I mean, yeah, no matter of speaking. Sure. And your skull can occasionally stop bullets. Yeah. I saw this thing where it said, if somebody is born feet first, does that mean for a split second they're wearing their mom as a hat? <laughs> and the guy who read it pauses and is like, I fucking hate you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's enough internet for today. So what if we experimented in that we ought not do a thing? Say what? So what if we experimented in that we ought not to have been? You know, like, you know, in Doom 3, it was teleporters. Jurassic Park, it was DNA genetic, or it was dinosaur DNA. Yeah. I gotta say it like little cartoon guy. Dead Space. What did they do in Dead Space? Alien uh, artifacts. Yeah, well, and it was also a oh. so like, from the get go. Get over here. Right? Resident Evil, it was bioweapons. Yeah. <gasps> um, oh, that guy. Whoa, what the heck? That guy is messed up looking. Fuck, he scared the shit out of me. <laughs> yeah, he turned around and there he was. Yeah, I was not expecting... I, I haven't seen a guy who looked like that before. Like, I, I was, almost was, expected more He was a little there. husky. Yeah. Well, 
watch out, watch out, watch out! For KO! This guy will not die. I mean, he's already dead, technically, but... Yeah. Oh, jeez! He doesn't like to... Dad, gum. He's tanky. Ooh, sweep the leg. <laughs> did you just say sweep the leg? I mean, yeah. That's what, he did, <laughs> isn't it? what it looks like. Dr. Howard? Dr. Fine? <laughs> Healer. Oh, oh, that's where he came he from. He dropped. Drop there. You know, I, I've, I've started to make this unfun realization when it comes to zombie apocalypse movies in that why don't they just wait for the zombies to starve? Yeah, that's, that's actually a legitimate question. I think it's supposed to be implied that zombies don't starve. They have to, though, by necessity. Yeah. They, they cannot be perpetual machines. Unless they're magic zombies. At that, at that point... Magic zombies... Interestingly enough, magic zombies make more sense than bio zombies. Yeah, in I mean, that if, if... they don't starve. In that they don't starve. R right, yeah. Yeah, because you can... Once magic is in play, then you can kind of just hand wave a lot of stuff. And well, if, it, especially, to be serious, like, if, if magic is what animates it, then... You know, what animates us is the series of chemical reactions that release energy and then other things that take that energy and transfer it into other kinds of, like, things, right? Whereas right. magic, if that's the animating force, then all you need is magic. Is Then all you need to keep it animated is magic. So, yeah. Yeah, I think I, I I read the zombie survival guide ages ago, and I want to say there was a like there was a passage in there that was basically just if if you wait this out long enough, you're fine. Yeah. Eventually, their body will cease to function because yeah. Because I mean, they are decaying too. Like they they are necrotic. Yeah, they're decaying, and and ultimately they'd still need some form of quote unquote calorie to keep the corpse animated, right? right so, right. yeah, I mean, you could you could allow them, you know, the idea that they're you know more efficient or they've got fewer yeah. things running, so they. Yeah, like yeah. the virus. The virus hijacks their metabolism and makes it super efficient. Like that, I yeah. could buy. Yeah, or like shuts off certain things, so you don't need as much energy. Yeah, actually, like yeah. the brain. I mean, you think about it. The brain uses a lot of energy. The yeah. brain's dead, and if the yeah. if half of your internal organs, like your lungs, aren't working and don't need to be, yeah, that would actually that would work out well. well. Your lungs would need to be working, actually. 
not if the not if it's actually like if it's a virus that's replicating and basically forming its own bloodstream, I guess. Uh, yeah, but you'd still have to be getting oxygen to your cells. <laughs> I mean, you, you'd have to have some... Some kind of respiration. Yeah. Well, then your liver. You probably wouldn't need your liver. Yeah, you could. I mean, yeah, if you're a zombie, you can get away with the liver or the kidneys or. I mean, really, anything. Well, no, you still need your intestines. So, yeah, liver and kidneys are back at point. Nice. Maybe one lung. Although, I wouldn't voluntarily choose to not have a lung for sure. Probably wouldn't need any of your nervous system since virus could technically be its own nervous system. Yeah, I mean, yeah, if it's if it's doing enough to like basically build a nervous system on top of your body, maybe. But yeah. At that point, it's it's less your traditional zombie virus and more just like a massive parasite. Ah, oh, fair. Which I, I think, isn't that how they did The Last of Us? Last of Us like is was, a fungus. Yeah, okay. Which, I mean, no, technically, yeah, it's a parasite. It's a yeah. It's a fungal parasite that reanimates the corpse or hijacks the corpse, basically. Yeah, it's like that um, that real thing that affects ants, I want to say. Yes. Which is terrifying that that exists. Yep. Nature is horrifying. You want to know what else is terrifying? There is a cactus that I learned about today. I was today years old when I learned about this thing called the teddy bear cactus. And it is a cactus that can actually detach and lob, like, prickly segments at passers-by. Okay. For, like, defensive reasons? Or, like, yeah. seed spreading? Oh, okay. For defensive That's... reasons. Huh. Yeah, that's a little scary. That sounds like a Final Fantasy character. <laughs> right? Pet wall. Time for a jump scare. Okay, so it does want me to keep pressing it. Ooh, that's that's a bad day. That's a conscious. <clears throat> that was how, human decision. How did you have enough time to create this house of horrors? That this disaster has been going on for like a day at this point. Not even a day. You know. Elevator. That'll get you up here, yeah? A dumb waiter. Secret, secret. I found a secret. A lunchbox. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. It's a slightly more aggressive way to open a lunchbox than you probably needed to do, but it worked. My text alert went off. Jacob has played Doom. I'm going to need 
you to zoom in on that soda because there's I'm definitely trying. a joke there. <laughs> I'm trying. That's starting. The swing cola? That's that no Shining cola? I don't know. Sure about that. It's gonna lower you down nice and easy. That's not nice. Break so look too good. Elias! I'm trying. One of the motors shorted out when I transferred power. Stop the cap! Stop it! Elias! The system's not responding! You've gotta do it manually! Wait, what? How? Just jam something into the brake! I hope he's closing his eyes. Yeah. That'd be a lot of... Oof. Jacob, you still with me? Yeah. Barely. I need to figure out why this system's acting up. Reset the power down there and get to the other elevator. You're nearly here. Another elevator. Can't wait. <laughs> Tech support in space. <gasps> <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I beg your pardon. Oh, I'm pressing. All right, so somebody saw the Necromorphs and uh, decided to do another one. Like, they found a way to turn a human into a bobbit worm. <laughs> there are true facts about the human bobbit worm. chance anything <laughs> um. you ever heard the story about dead space and how that in dead space one the long tentacle that grabs you and drags you through the hallway uh, you ever hear the story about how that almost that the studio under. Oh, did they just have to spend so much time animating? They had to it? spend a ton of time on that singular scene. Not bad. But it it, it's well one done. of the. I pressed. It's it's one of the most freaky scenes of the whole game. <clears throat> it makes the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that was the scene that everyone was talking about when it came out. So mm. uh, honestly, now, worth it. now I gotta heal again. Well, good thing you have a Healy thingy. <laughs> but not Healy's. You just have a heal thingy, not Healy's. And that would be useful in a horror scenario. <laughs> oh no, I need to get away from the zombies. Let me just glide. Click. <laughs> you know, the fact that we don't still have those is just like we've we've failed as a society. I always wanted a pair of Heelys, to be honest. I, they're kind of a good idea. <laughs> they're I, not, yeah, they're not a bad idea. I <laughs> tried a pair out one time, and I feel like I nearly died. I mean, you're what they A human jack in the box, that's what it is. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> like chuckles, huh? <laughs> huh? My lower half is now a spring. I don't have a penis anymore. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is this from? It's <laughs> from Legends of Avantress. Oh, okay. <laughs> I pressed the damn...
Oh, oh. Oh, that would have been cool. Just grab the guy and throw him. Yeah. What? What? There's a guy behind you. Fucking hell! Speaking of worms that took a whole lot of effort, did you ever see, uh, I think it was the third Michael Bay Transformers movie? Where there's a... Uh... No, I didn't. Oh, okay. There's Honestly, a scene with... I don't know that I saw past Transformers 1. Oh, really? Huh. Yeah. Well, Bumblebee is good. I heard uh, Bumblebee was good. The... Right, I said beast, I think. Oh, shoot. I think that's a spike wall behind him. No, it's not. JK. Oh, uh, yeah. No helpful yellow. Oh, but there was a fan. Oh, yeah, look at that. Yeah, that would have been cool. Of course, Carrie Brown. <laughs> we had that segue I was going to make. Oh, good, so. good, good, good. Lots of things. Um, What were you going to say, Eric? The, the segue I was going to make earlier, the, the, there's a scene in... I, I think it's the third one where it, imagine like a tremors worm but like transformers like like you know a mechanical tremors worm that's it's like, horrifying oh yeah. yeah it was it was a scary robot monster uh apparently it took them like a day to render each frame of that thing really yeah <laughs> it, it, Hey, Johnny, I, I saw... Yeah, I saw it, too. Inside. Okay, just making sure. Yeah, I saw it, too. Okay, go ahead, Eric. Did it with a whole day just for a single frame, or...? There, Eric. Hear me? Damn it! Yeah, I can hear you now. Okay, that was weird. Uh, when did I drop him? Uh, something about a single frame for a, or a whole day for a single frame. Oh yeah, I mean that, that was just the point I was making. It was just you know, because it was a super detailed monster, like. Yeah, you think about all the little moving parts that were on uh, yeah. robot designs in those movies. Uh, blow that up to the size of, like, a 747. Ooh. A-maker. Nice shot. Oh! No! Yeah. Oh. I think this have any arms. The Black Knight of the Callis Callisto Protocol. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Except he is actually going to chew your legs off. <laughs> I'll bite your legs off, you yellow Did you bastard. see how that guy had no head, but he still had a second pair of jaws? 
Yeah, that was what was freaking me out the most. How it about like you a- guys? More a yeah. eel when the jaws open wide and there's more jaws inside. It's some more Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Got that thing. Damn it. Is there an, was there another one behind me? No, I think that guy threw out a one two combo. No, because one spat at me. No, I think that one just didn't die yet. It'll work. Damn it. Oh, you got three total. I'll just... Oh, they have friendly fire. I think you got one coming up behind you. Good eye, Eric. This is why I wear headphones. I don't have any headphones. I haven't bought in the new area. What's yet. the fucking? Especially from like hell divers, just having directional sound. It's helpful. Is... Yeah, I mean, in a game like this. Fucking hell! That was amazing. Yeah. Oh, two more. I. Okay, so there's three spitters. Yeah, one of them is... I wonder if you can hit the other one before... So turn to your left, turn to your left. Uh Uh-huh. Because that one came up from behind you. I'm trying to figure out where he came from. I 
think he might just be scripted to pop up and overwhelm me. I think I'm good enough to play this game. <laughs> <laughs> Get good, you filthy casual. On your left. I guess that's all you need to do is just take them on a little bit by little bit. Yeah, it makes sense. Okay, so he popped out of this little tunnel. That's what happened. But yeah, yeah, it is a scripted sort of thing. Yeah. Do you have any healing things? There was also a thing on the wall. Did you already pick that one up? Yeah, that's what this one is. Reload the damn thing. <laughs> All right. It's a perfect day. Nothing can go wrong. Oh, that's probably explosive. Yeah, I wouldn't shoot that unless you have to. Oh, but I bet you could pick it up and throw it at a guy. Yeah.
<laughs> you know those bug assault shotguns? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you know they have a revolver? Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> version of it. It's so you. You. It actually. And it actually like. You. You actually have six barrels of salt that you shoot, like. <laughs> Um, but it, it's also CO2 powered. Oh, that's maybe slightly excessive for killing a fly, but... Hey, that just means you can work. kill roaches with it. That'd be fair. I'm down with killing roaches. You know, if you had, like, a blue laser... Size of what thing? I'm in the elevator, I see the shoe. Oh! Oh. Elias, you there? Oh, fuck. Elias is probably dead. Probably. Yeah. Elias, can you hear me? I mean, it would be nice to be survived. Meanwhile, he's in one of those situations where he can't turn his comms off, but I'm still coming through and he's trying to hide. Right. Oh, there he is. Sorry for not responding. This thing's found a way inside here. Really tearing up the place. Can we still get to the shoe? Yeah, but it's on emergency power, so I'll need to stay here and run a manual override. Don't worry. I can get you over there. I'm activating the gondola right now. It'll carry you across. How'd you even get here? What about Wu and Wei? <laughs> Do you really want another Dynasty Warriors game? Because they will make one. I mean, I would prefer yeah. that. I would prefer that over cowering in fear in this game. <laughs> if the shoe fits, <laughs> is the trophy I just got. Oh, nice. <laughs> I like how trophies have basically become a way for the developers to put puns into their game. Yeah. Either puns or a we see you gamers. Yeah. Like the uh, Final Fantasy 16 trophy, you can pet the dog. Yes. Or when Colonial Marine of all games said yellow makes it go faster. <laughs> I mean, if you think about it, the the, uh, the uh, aliens Colonial Marines are just like one of the major spiritual ancestors for the Imperial Guard, so... It, it makes sense. Yeah. Ooh, heavy swing. I'll take that. Yes. We're printing you the ability to swing harder. <laughs> Just a little note that says, just, just swing harder. I, I don't... <laughs> R1. Swing harder to swing harder. Yeah. Gondola, Jacob. Get on it. It seems like it'll be useful against... Uh, your guys that aren't too fast. Yeah. Or even if or, or it even actually sounds like it would have been could time it right. useful in that situation we were just in. Right? I wonder how much more damage it would do. I have
Uh oh. That means death. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, that's you you're missing yikes. That's that's brain matter. I would have rather they the just removed the whole head, to be honest. Yeah. Somehow less was more. <laughs> I'm not going to complain, right? Which we do to, to uh, keep moving forward. Just a minute. I'm supposed to just...
Hmm. Have to call it in a few minutes. <clears throat> All good. Um, not quite sure what the game wants me to do. I'm an idiot. I'd rather not, but... <laughs> I got a trophy called Workplace Hazard. <laughs> oh, shit. Thank you for letting me reload. <laughs> Die? I, I think so. Okay, I die. <laughs> <laughs> that's all right. I'm gonna go ahead and call it. Yeah, that's as good a point to call it as any. I will talk to you later. Love you. Alrighty. Talk to everyone later. Bye.